This one's so cute. I love this color. Oh, mira una canasita. What is up, you guys? You're watching Sergio's Secret. Before I get started with today's video, everything will be linked down below, including my outfit. And today we are at the mall. Today we are going to be just, I guess, window shopping in a sense. I say that, but I always somewhat, somehow walk out with something. So my birthday's in about a month. It's on September 4th. So uh, Beyonce shares a birthday with me. I don't share a birthday with Beyonce. Okay, okay, okay. What y'all know about that? And so I will be 22 and I do not know what I want. I do know what I want, but I just kind of want to walk through kind of get inspired and see what i want to spend my coins on because you guys know that i hate to get birthday presents that's my biggest pet peeve people give me gifts honestly give me like a dunkin donuts gift card honestly or starbucks something that i already spent my money on i hate to be given gifts because i always get disappointed and so because i always get disappointed i'd rather just buy the items myself it's about that time for real I, that's just always been me and so i'm bringing you guys along the mis amigas vámonos ir de shopping even though que no vamos a ir shopping amiguis no sé la mera verdad pero van a venir conmigo so andale vamos y es, es un sábado it's like so packed them all and so girl i like coming when it's packed i'm gonna tell you why if you ever guys want to vlog it's better to do it like on a busy weekend because like it's not awkward when you go during the week and there's like no people in the mall and so you can kind of get away with filming and stuff because a lot of the employees are more distracted um and so that's why i always prefer to do it on the weekend versus the weekdays so that is the real tea and so let's go ahead and go and see what we can find so in a sense i feel like this is also going to be a catch-up videos with you guys so i don't really like to take the elevator here at the gallery i feel like it's kind of spooky um i love my outfit it's kind of cropped with these like jeans that i got a while ago um I'm supposed to be a catch up, so I have like a lot of things to tell you guys about, and you guys have always come through about a lot of things. And look at my little bear from Harrods when I went to London. I'm definitely um, overdue to go back uh, very, very soon. This is exactly why I mean I hate kind of coming to the mall on a busy Saturday, especially during the Texas heat, because everybody doesn't want to be outside. Um, this is exactly what I mean, but it's also the best time to do vlogging, in my opinion. So if you guys ever want to do it, um that's the perfect time frame that i suggest you guys to do. first stop obviously coach oh, i love this great color and i love the little flap on it it's magnetic so this is definitely on my birthday wish list i already know i'm getting it i just don't know what color i usually like to wait and buy things all for my birthday like not necessarily all at once but once it's kind of like the second week counting down I kind of start like two weeks before and two weeks after my birthday is when I start buying stuff I see I thought I wanted the black on black but I feel like I already have my Lulu and I feel like that's like a little bit too much I want a color that I don't have that I would wear and I feel like I would wear this a lot with black with like my totem quilted jacket I feel like this one will go with it but uh, I love the size and then I have these this beautiful line with the silver I wouldn't wear it they have a pink one colors that I don't usually go for these are very madrina bags so if you're mama madrina tia your auntie this is, these are like the auntie bags you know like this is like we're gonna go to ihop because this is what my mom would wear uh, we're gonna go get uh run errands we're gonna go to hcb -E and this is the vibe that it gives me just love the hardware with it but i'm not sure i mean get the black one or the white one you know you guys me up when it comes to the color of the handbags especially uh if, if it's been one that i've been wanting I'm very predictable, and as far as the color, I tend to get the same one, but you guys been knew that, so um, there's that. And then they have kind of like the Perry looking tote here. From I feel like they have a better selection than like last time that I was in here. They still have that pride bag, not a big fan of that. Uh, no, actually, I feel like it's all the same stuff. I feel like just new variations. They have the little studio. Um, in the glove tan leather. As you can see, it does have like light scratching. It gets scratched quite easily, but for me, I feel like it gives the bag more personality. You know, I feel like I just had like a little tag. There's like so many people at the mall. I was like, oh my God, that's a little bit too much for me. They have this peachy color. This one's on sale for 40% off. So it's about like 297. It doesn't even have a tag on it, but I'm assuming it's 297. I have this denim collection. But that's a little too small for me. Not a fan of this. Now the swinger, yes. Give me the swinger all day, every day. 
even with the even my shade of denim does not match but it's definitely something that um i would wear all the time i'm just like a fan of it and it, and it has this longer strap i'm gonna go to the coach store um to the actual store and see what they have and they have a little hero crossbody with a little fabric in here i love this as well and then they have some soft tabbies in a few colors um, I think I should give you guys an outfit of the day before I forget because I'm pretty much on the Okay, so this is gonna be my thumbnail. It's from Totem. I got it on Essence. These are Tom Ford. I got these at Neiman's. Roberto Coin Neiman's. Uh, Ritzia. Like it's not a bodysuit. It's like the version of the bodysuit, but it's kind of cut out. Um, I don't like it because sometimes it ruches on very high waisted pants. And so this is from a Ritzia. It's a size small. This is a Frankie Shop shirt that I got on Farfetch size small um my five seven back from saint laurent your friendship bracelet Cartier um tank uh levi jeans i actually had these since my sophomore year of high school everybody always made fun of them they would always say they look like something my cousin would wear because he has kind of like this style and then some disgusting beat up golden gooses and i just felt like the golden goose color of the shirt went with the shoes and so that's why i went for it but that's my outfit it's very much it's giving very casual vibes, giving very much Prada nylon vibes. But they do have like, I don't know, I feel like I like the selection that they had at the Woodlands a little bit better. But I am loving these Brahmi moments. Not this one for me in particular, but I do love this one. And I love that bucket bag moment. That's super, super cute. And then let's go visit my friends at Michael Kors to see what they have. Ooh, look, some Carl Lagerfeld bags. Uh, they're very juvenile that's for show these are all the juvenile bags they only have the juvenile <laughs> section of it okay dkny we have a little bit of a charm moment i ordered a starbucks refresher and i'm waiting for it it's delicioso me gusta mucho oh mira esas están como poquito raritas this is very different for dkny how much do they want let's guess i don't even know i want to say probably 248 Oh, 158. I don't know, I feel like sometimes they price them a little expensive so they can have like, so they can go on promo. And it's not bad. I mean, I wouldn't wear it, the monogram one, but I would definitely wear this. This de this is giving, um, definitely giving Colt Gaia vibes. I don't know, I think it's like the Havana um, handle, the acrylic, that's what it's giving. And they have a bunch of Michael Kors on sale. Um, they have these little, um, PVC ones, a Greenwich one, cute or whatever. Oh my god, they have these that have Michael Kors on the side. That's a very nice detail. I did like this. I did compliment this. I wonder if they have the. Oh yeah, they do have the collection that um, that they shot for when I was in Austin last month. So let's take a look at that. Oh my god, these are new. I did not see these. These perforated little moment Michael Kors okay 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 it's here and then they have this one here too this one's super super cute and this little PVC moment I feel like I'm kind of overdue for a pair of glasses. Oh, this looks cute. So my friend Ross has these. I don't know if they're these gigantic or like more of the circle ones. I'm gonna take my hat off. I want a pair of Mimi glasses, but oh my God, these are gigantic. Like demasiado grande. And then these ones are a little bit smaller. And they want 328. Oh, I like these a lot more. These are a lot more cuter. This one in white would be perfect. Because I, I already have the classic ones, but I feel like they're too big. There's not like a lot of these. I like these a lot too. But they have the nose thing, so they're a little bit more delicate. This is the monitas. Pero I really want the Mimi's, but. I like the Versace ones. I texted my friend Ross um, about them and then I texted my other friend Connie to see what she thinks. 
because I feel like I'm due for another pair. I could also do a pair of Celine's too. Quite interesting. 480. These kind of give me that Oakley vibe, but still my style, if you know what I mean. These aren't bad at all, actually. I thought I wasn't gonna like them. 510, these are Asian fit. No, this is not, I don't really care for these as much. I feel like these are like way too gay. Absolutely not. But they got more expensive, those are Chanel. They're 675. These in black would be pretty too. My friend has these. And I think that color. And they have a little bit of Cartier. And then some Jimmy Choo. It's funny because they put the Ray-Bans here. And you would think that people would steal the other brands more. All of these Tom Fords too. I like the flat top. My friend Alexis has these in black. Oh yeah, I like them. They're a little too small than what I'm used to. Oh, and then these ones here. So these are named that. Esta se llama Enrique. Oh, I kind of like these too. These are kind of cute for like an aloe set, kind of like a workout set, and then to like run around errands. These would be cute for that. I'm not a big fan of the Fendi ones. I feel like they're a little bit too much for my tasting. I like the other ones a little bit better. For Tori, they have these that are 30% off. Um, the new styles of the Eleanor's that have the adjustable strap. Super cute. I have it in the cream color too. They keep telling me that they have the classic Lee's, the small ones half off at the outlet. So next week we're gonna go there to see if they have it. And if they do, I'm definitely gonna be purchasing some. And I'm also listing a lot of things from my Poshmark. Um, if you guys want to check it out, um, I'll leave it at the, at the description box, um, and I'll do a community post for it, too. I don't know, I feel like none of the Toy Birch bags have been wowing me, but I feel like I have so much Toy Birch, you know what I mean? I just really want the Lee. I feel like that's the one that I've been wanting to get for the longest. And that's the one that's been calling my name. But I like all the fixtures and stuff that they have here. I think it's super cute. It so went on sale at Dillard's for 65% off. I think they're still available. Um, but they're super cute. But they're not like like a color scheme that I would wear a lot. It would just be like a moment bag. They have, I like that denim one too. Oh, they have some Rosie Hudson and White Lee Gia. A little busy. I, I like coming here when it's not super busy. I mean, when it's busy. Mm. This is some bonitas. 316, so they're 60% off. I heard Neiman Marcus is having a really good shoe sale too. The A for in Givenchy. And these are all in my sizes too. I don't I think these are so not my style. 476. But I could see myself wearing these though. 276. It looks like a little glitter bomb. It looks like a flower bomb. If flower bomb was a shoe, this would definitely be it. These Valentino, $2.94, but they're all rubber, so yes, I can do it mucho. And then this, I've always been a big fan of metallic, but I feel like they always, always um, get scratched very easily, like siempre. And this Sherpa girl, my feet finna sweat. But they're cute though, for sure. These are cute, $500. So this is the bag that I want for my birthday, essentially. I love it because it has the leather strap on it. It has in a chain one. So you have the chain and it has the leather strap. And it's tiny enough where I can get away with wearing it everywhere. So I'm going to compare it next to my bag. It's really not that big of a difference, but I feel like this is more casual every day, and I feel like that's more glam. And I feel like that's why I like it a little bit more. It gives me like that extra mm. But now that I see the white, I probably don't want it in white. I probably want it in another color. I like this one too, but I like 
this one a little bit more. I feel like it's like the perfect everyday bag. And they just got Celine two days ago here. I wonder if Neiman still has it. I feel like it's better here because there's more foot traction. This is the Trumfit bag, Trumfit. I love that bag. It's very classic and elegant. Every brand has a version of it. Oh, mira una canasita. This one's so cute. I love this color. The Chloe bag. A Tess. But I'm not like usually like a big fan. And a lot of me queen. Me queen, me queen. But I can't believe they have Celine now. But I love it. And they have Burberry bags here too. I like this little jelly one. It's super cute. And they have some Burberry bags. Definitely want to add one too. And then these ones are $12.50, these little baby ones. But I wouldn't get a small one. I feel like this that one makes a little bit more of a statement. And this is a small Olympia. And then this one's in the in the coated canvas. I feel like this is a bag that I want to add too, because it's super lightweight. And this one's very, very easy to travel with. Very, very easy. Oh my god, so much mousy denim. Like mousy denim, like heaven. They have so much of it. They have moved the Anina Bing into the back into the front. Oh my god, they have mousy denim for days. A lot of mother jeans. I definitely do want another pair of mother jeans. Almost some mother shorts. I've never owned a pair of mother shorts. They want two twenty eight for them. Let's go into the Anina. Oh, they have even Celine ready to wear. So they have a whole Celine section in general. Oh my god. So that's a new brand that they have here at Saks now. Like I said, I wonder if Norch, uh, Neiman's has it now. And they just have a really pretty Gucci boutique. I mean, you guys already seen the vlogs, but this is cute. So my trip feet bags. Gorgeous. Love, love, love. I love Celine Ready Tour. Like the little suit that I have, I love it. Like look at the skirt. Look how it moves. I love these little boxing shorts. And they want $17.50 for them. So this is the bra top. That's four. I believe this is the one that's either 400 or six, uh, seven, six something. It's like in the technical fabric. But I definitely do want one of these. Because uh, I wear like a lot of crop -y items and I feel like this would be cute. What do you guys think? Oh my god, they have so much pretty Celine ready to wear. I mean, I wouldn't get something like this. This is cute. I feel like this is a little cheesy. Like, it's just not my style. Let me rephrase it. Like, this is cute. But I'm kind of over kind of like the simple things. Even though the bra top is simple, but it has like, you know, it's not super Celine-ish in your face. Well, maybe it is. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. Bum on. We're just walking through here like we usually do. Oh my god, I have not like window shop like birthday wish. I cannot believe my birthday is like a little over a month. I think that's kind of crazy. So much blueberry. Max Mara. Michael Kors collection. Oh, so they moved Montclair here. I forgot what is here, but I can go back into the vlogs and check. Maybe it was Acris. I don't know. Michael Kors, we love you so much. We stand you. Prentice schooler. Have a little bit of Versace ready to wear. 
they have even the Jean Couture line mixed with it. The little print, gorgeous. I've always loved this print. It's always a little flashy for me. Oh, they have some Sergio Hudson, obviously, because my name is Sergio, so we're here for it. Here's some sale ready to wear, which we'll take a quick look at. Oh my God, they have a lot of designer finale. This is beautiful. I think it's like a little bodysuit moment. It's a little mesh. I also love this. This is super cute. This is 620 and then it's additional 20% off. This is super cute. Oh my God, they have some row on sale, like this shirt for 396. Blue shirt. I feel like the only one that I like is this blue shirt and it's a size four. And this beautiful chocolate brown one. Love the row. It's very similar to this one, but the other one's a uh, three-fourth sleeve on it. Oh my god, these bags are definitely interesting. I've never seen it. I, I will always say I like the selection of sacks. This sacks really has everything. The little bag that I had in brown that I ended up giving it to my friend because it was a little too tiny for my frame. I feel like I was like, I'm a little bit too tall for it. And then obviously sacks started introducing Veronica Beard like a year ago. They have like all the, they have so much nice stuff. Uh, I definitely do want to look at the Anina Bean and then we'll walk into the mall and everything else. So like I said, I'm trying to be good just because I really want to stick to what I want. And I, I just texted all my friends and all my friends said that the Valentino bag is, I should definitely get it. Only out of, and then one of my friends who's into designer, well not really into designer, but knows a thing or two, was like, oh, is that, what brand is that? And I, and I said, well, that's why I love, that's why I like it because you said what brand is that so it makes me you know it makes me more intrigued where'd they move Anina being so they have a Dior children now here so this is pretty much like this uh, they have this pretty much kind of like the one that I'm wearing but this mine's from the Frankie shop and some the dress but they have the shirt on sale that sucks this is a cute one too this is very much like a good the row version of it Shorts. I think one ninety nine. Oh my god, they have the Mimi glasses here. I'm not sure if I like these. I'm gonna try them on in white, you guys. Arlington, when I worked at the Park Small in at North Park. Oh my god, people would do that all the time. I mean, I'm not hating, you know, some people be liking hating. Why are they doing it at the mall? Girl, it's hot outside. Who wants to be outside when you're wearing that dress? Let, let the girl wear it inside. This mall's big enough where we can all walk through it, right? Am I wrong or am I right? I don't know. Oh, I didn't know that it had the Chanel on the side like that. That's cute. That's actually for a cute picture. So the Chanel 19, uh, I mean 22. Uh, such a trash can bag. Such a trash can bag. <laughs> we have, we have this little frog bag. It's adorable. Very different. Huh? 
همه چی سی... Skimming through some of the ready to wear. That tote bag is very different. I actually really like it just because it's such a novelty bag. I think it's so different. I don't know. I feel like the ready to wear these last few seasons have definitely. This is from the summer capsule. This is the only store in Texas that actually received the capsule. They have the little classic tunic. It's a little bit on the sheer side, obviously, because it's meant to be more as a cover up. Have a little skirt or skirt because it's a little short in the back. Yes, thank you so much. Appreciate it. This one's cute too. These look like little poke and in, in my ranch in Mexico. Super cute. And then here's more from that summer capsule collection. I actually like this little charm. It's quite interesting. Oh, look, some tea sport. And look, these are cute if you want added height. These are so cute. Royal blue. Okay, this is a shoe that I would not buy myself because I don't like flats, but these are really pretty. The Toy Birch Miller sandals had a price decrease. Yeah, FY, if you guys are wondering. A tote that's up there. That is super cute. I love that. We have to visit my sister, Michael Kors. You know, we have to. And then, there's a line at Louis Vuitton. But let's see what they have here at my sister's store. To show love to Mr. Michael Kors. We love him. I love this one because Lori Harvey is the face of this one. I love how big this one is. I need to throw my drink away. I feel like it's in the way. I didn't even know they had Michael Kors collection. I feel like last time I may have missed it. This woven one, oh, beautiful. I'm gonna try this baby on. Oh my god, this Michael Kors collection one. I bet it worked because I'm gonna sell the truth. This reminds me of something that I would have in high school. That I would play my little laptop, like from the children's place. Oh, super cute. Lori Harvey, where are you? Oh my god, they have some of these little lunch boxes. And still ones, these Bradshaws, girl, pop off. They're so pretty. And I love the little case for AirPods. I think it's so beautiful. Okay guys, it is Sunday the next day. This is the same day that the vlog is going to come out. Um, I got a haircut yesterday and that ended, ended up hanging out with some of my um, Asian friends and I always forget that a lot of my Vietnamese friends are just like Mexicans. I feel like we always, I always forget that Vietnamese people and Hispanics or Mexicans, we have a lot in common. So I got to kiki it up and it was pretty fun. Um, right now I'm about to go to brunch and I'm wearing a Roberto Quinn necklace. This Burberry silk top. I'm wearing my Celine little pink sneakers. And then I'm wearing some Agody denim that have a little bit of a crop. And I wanna talk about the item that I saw yesterday and what I do and don't wanna add into my wish list. So yesterday we saw everything. I wanna say the Valentino bag is a yes. I do really like it. I was really impressed with it. The Celine bra top, I feel like it's something that I'm gonna buy probably next weekend and the Mew Mew glasses were definitely a yes. 
So I just wanted to kind of see and play around and take a look at everything before I kind of like made a decision. And so I'm very, very happy that I saw everything and I'm super happy and excited. Some of you guys were here for it, some of you guys were not. I let you guys vote on, vote on Instagram and that's why I always tell you guys to follow me on Instagram because I, I love to hear your guys' opinions and your output on a lot of different things. And then also today's the last day of the anniversary sale, so I'll make sure to leave a link uh, in case you want to get any last minute shopping. And my eyebrows look low-key kind of good and I don't really have anything on them. Well, I don't have anything on them. I don't feel like wearing anything today. I'm just wearing nothing but sunscreen because, you know, we're not trying to get, you know, I'm trying to age well. And this is the one that I'm using, this Super Goop Play one. But yeah, I want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. I love each and every single one of you. And I'll do one for TJ Maxx within the next few days. And I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys. And uh, I feel amazing and refreshed and now it's time for Sunday fun day.